Welcome back to another Let's Talk here on JD's YouTube. I am not doing this green screen for now on for the uh, Let's Talks. I'm going to do it like this. So this is more personal. Uh, I like my Let's Talks. Make them a little more personal. Do it like this. So you're not distracted by all the cool things. Uh, you can see Bob in the background. Hi, Bob. <laughs> Today is... Today I want to talk about playing the part versus being the part. Um, and again, this is all of my opinion. Um, I am a big believer. If you are doing something you are not happy, then you should change it. And that is one of the big difference between playing the part and being the part. Uh, there's many key factors. Playing the part is going for a job that... That you don't um, necessarily enjoy, but you know that with your set of skills you can get by. Uh, playing the part is just getting by. Um, it never works out in the wrong, long end. Either you're you get worn out from playing the part, or you um, get caught not knowing. <laughs> but you shouldn't strive for just okay. You should strive for excellence. And so being the part is, you know, knowing what you're good at, knowing what you enjoy, and doing the research. I have learned that if you if you are enjoying something, you enjoy doing the research. Um, you'll just find enjoyment out of it, and it will uh, it'll make things a whole lot easier. Um, I can't explain it. You really have to try it. Uh, most people do not do what they want to do in fear of failing. Uh, that's another thing about being the part versus playing the part. I can go flip burgers. I don't I don't want to. Um, I'll be miserable in a fast food restaurant, but I can do it. I can do it. So I can play that part. I can do it very well, but... And it, it wouldn't make me happy. It wouldn't last for too long. Um, you can tell it's a difference between an A-list actor and a sub somebody uh, lower than them. Like an A-plus to an A. Uh, those people endure their role. Um, those people aren't there to make a paycheck. They are there to entice and embrace the role that they have been given they're there to become that role instead of just doing the minimum research on that role and just and just doing it um, I believe that if you find your role you look inside yourself because we all know what we're good at we all know what we're not we all know what we're passionate about we all do know what we're not um, we know what we like and what we don't like. We just gotta reach in there and pull it out. And people are afraid of that because they're afraid of, of failing. And you shouldn't be afraid of failing. A lot of people fail. Um, a lot of big people fail. And then, you know, they pick themselves up from there. And Tom Brady was a backup quarterback forever. Uh, he is now a GOAT, but he was a backup. He was drafted as a backup. He was a backup. Um, who knows what happened if he would just been like, just played that part. But he became that part. There is a story of a, um, I don't know his name. But there's a story of a football player who became a huge football player. And he was a, a dumpster baby. And he shouldn't have been able to become who he became. He could have just spent the rest of his life and just been like, circumstances stopped me. My parents don't love me. Um, he could have used any excuse in the book just to do okay and have people pity him. But he chose not to. He chose his passion. He chose his what made him happy. And he went with it. 
even though everything else had told him not to. Um, I am a great father. I am a well-rounded person. I do, I give more than I receive. But my circumstances, I could have took the easy way out. I could have just been like, well, you know, my father was an alcoholic, so I'm an alcoholic. Um, my grandfather's an alcoholic. I'm an alcoholic. Temper runs in my family, so I have a temper. I could have blamed everything. I could have blamed my circumstances. I could have bl- blamed anything I wanted to, but I don't. Um, I wanted to be a better person, a more rounded person that makes me happy. I didn't just want to play the part of victim. I want to be the part of the hero, the the guy who sacrifices, the guy who wakes up and is happy that it is a new day, the guy who gives more than he gets. But I could have played victim. That could have been easy. Could have been easy enough. But I didn't. I don't want to. I do not want to play that part. I want to be me. I want to be JD. So you, you lovely motherfuckers, you go be you. Don't be the victim. Don't think you have to be something for somebody else. Don't think you have to be something because society wants you to be that way. You lovely bastards. Do me a favor and go be you. Uh, With that being said, much love, JD, out.